to come out their driveways or clean. They're like, what happened? Earl was here. And they know, we know who it was. Earl, it's been an Earl attack. On Melody Lane in Jefferson County, it's not the snow that's surprising neighbors. It's the lack thereof. And I didn't even hear him clean my driveway. I came out and there's no snow going. And then I see him out here going, oh, it's Earl again. Yeah. Kelly Stoll lives right across the street from Earl Miller. She says Earl and his bright red snowblower have been confronting this winter's wintry mix head on. I think he could go all the way around the subdivision if he could just just take a snowblower around the neighborhood and clean everybody's house and your driveway. It's not an easy task. It takes a lot of focus, snow in your face, and a little elbow grease. You know, and he's not young by any means, but he's so thriving and everything, and I just really appreciate it too. Earl says he's been living in Arnold for about two years, and this is something he does from the heart. I don't, I don't think it's a big deal. It's just something you do. Sunday morning, Arnold got about three inches of snow, making this winter the most he's cleared in a long, long time. We'll probably get hit one more time. I hope this is it. I think everybody's about tired of it. And uh, I don't mind. I mean, for me, it could snow all the time. For his neighbors who wake up to the sight of pavement instead of snow, a simple thank you will never be enough. He doesn't act, ask for anything in return, you know, and I've tried to do things for him and he's embarrassed. He doesn't want me to do this, like, but I have to. Earl took us into his garage and he's ready for more snow. He has about five bags of salt ready and he thinks he'll use them by the end of this winter. And I'm hoping he won't. Reporting live in Jefferson County, Jasmine Payute, Five on Your Side. I think we all wish we had a neighbor like Earl. Jasmine, be careful on the ice, get home safe. Thank you very much.